Here are four ways that I prepared myself to become a hijabi. Number one, I went ghost. I isolated myself and talked to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and just really tried to figure out what was my reasoning and what was my purpose of wanting to put the hijab on. Number two, I made so much dua. Like I literally was like, Allah, I don't even want to think about taking the hijab off, subhanAllah, when I put it on. I made a lot of dua. Number three, I made the intention. Like before I fully decided to put it on, but literally wear my hijab to the grocery store, to the gym. Not only would I wear the hijab, I would wear non-fitted clothes and things like that. Make the intention. Number four was acceptance and initiative. You need to accept that you will never fully be ready to wear hijab. The only thing that you can do is make the intention and do the best that you can for the sake of Allah. Accept that this new journey that you are pursuing, inshallah, will be amazing for you. I wrote down so many reasons in my journal to why I decided to put my hijab on or why I was thinking of putting my hijab on. So anytime I had doubts or anytime I spoke to somebody and they had a different opinion or is your modeling career going to be in jeopardy? I would literally go back to my journal and reread those things to remind myself that anything in this world, in this dunya that I was terrified of losing, Allah could take that away at any given point of time. Remember that when you give up something for the sake of Allah, you're never losing. Sometimes the thing that you think that you're giving up, it literally could be the blockage that stops you from getting something that your brain cannot even fathom. You're, it's The blessing may be so big that you have never even thought to make dua for it. So, inshallah, this journey for you is impeccable. Um, inshallah, you have the strength to be able to overcome the words the heat girl because i know it be hot and everything else may allah bring people into your life that make this journey easy for you and you remember that your hijab is a crown it is literally the recipe the key to success in this dunya because you represent allah and you represent islam you're doing this for the sake of allah